So these are just the streets of uh, Bombolulu. These are the kind of houses you can get in this area of Bombolulu. Yeah, so I think these are best cities, as you can see. These are the streets of Bombolulu. We're cooking samaki right here. This is the estate. Hello guys. Welcome to Bombolulu. So guys, I told you guys I want to be taking you to places that most of the people are, most of the YouTubers in Mombasa don't take you and don't show you guys. So I want to give you a tour of, just a little tour of Bombolulu. And uh, I'm in this area, area institution here in uh, uh, Mombasa, which is called the Bombolulu Workshop. It is one of the popular, it's one of the popular institution here in Mombasa. It's called the Bombolulu Workshop. You see how it is? This is the Mumululu workshop. I think most of the people in this uh, area, the students always uh, do some um, uh, jobs like uh, they are teach, uh, they are taught how to make furniture. Uh, uh, there's a cultural thing. I don't know so much about this institution, but it's one of the popular institutions I know here in Mombasa. So here in Bombolulu. So this is the Bombolulu workshop, and this is uh, the area which is called Bombolulu. This road is the road that takes you to the interior of Bombolulu. Bang. Kind of a tight road, but yeah. This one is the road that takes you to the Bombolulu stage, the Bombolulu workshop. If you have heard about Bombolulu workshop stage, this is the road that takes you there. And the guys, it is, uh, there's a funny rain right here. It's kind of raining, just a little kind of showers. And there's a cloud of, of rain. And it's kind of surprising because the other side of Mugoni is kind of sunny. And this side of Momolulu is kind of raining. So it's kind of funny. The weather of Mombasa is kind of tricky and very, very funny. So guys, so this... So this road takes you to Bombolulu. So let me just enter this side and show you guys how it is. So these are just the streets of uh, Bombolulu. These are the streets of Bombolulu. This is how Bombolulu looks like. These are the kind of houses you can get in this area of Bombolulu. As I told you guys, it's kind of raining right now and it's very surprising. So I need to just stay somewhere. Yeah, it's raining. Very surprising, guys. Yeah, so these are the kind of houses that you can get here in Bomolulu. These are the kind of houses. So let me just walk on this side. Funny rain, funny rain, very, very funny rain, very, very funny rain. See how it is. Uh -huh. Let me just still walk and show you guys the houses, even if it's raining, I'll just walk and show you guys how it is. But this is the kind of the houses that you can get here. All of this. So okay, this is Bombolulu. So this is the side of workshop. This is how it is. The side, uh, the side of Bombolulu workshop. This is how Bombolulu workshop looks like. The institution, the famous institution I've shown you. And these are the streets. These are the streets. Oh, Bombolulu. The rains are stopped. And I want to take to, I want to take this road here. This road takes you back to uh, Bombolulu Sports. Yeah. So these are the kind of houses you can get here. It's kind of cloudy right now. That's why it's kind of dark in this area of uh, Mombasa. This side of Bombolulu. It has been raining. See that dark cloud over there. So it's a challenge. So this road here takes you to uh, Bombolulu Sports. And Bombolulu Sports, uh, it joins you to Ziwa Langombe area. So the Ziwa Langombe area is where I'm taking you right now. 
and as I told you guys, I want to give you a tour of Bombrulu, just a little bit tour of it, showing you guys how it is, the kind of houses you can get in this area. Yeah, so I think these are best sitters, as you can see. This one here are best sitters. Huh. Bed sitters around here. Wow, okay. And I know these are like 5,000, 6,000 sh uh, shillings per month. Very nice bed sitter. It's wide. Yeah, nice bed sitter or one bedroom, something like that. All of this. Wow. This is a private compound. Someone living inside here. Uh huh. Yeah, so these are the streets of Bombolulu. So, again, if you haven't, uh, or if you have been in Bombolulu, tell me what's your experience and how do you find the area? Is it good or is it bad? Can you live in this area or you can't? Yeah? So, this is how it is. So this is the estate. So this is the estate of Bumbululu. I told guys it's kinda cloudy, but this is how it is. These are the corridors that I've come from, and this is the estate. I always don't like it when it's kinda cloudy, because most of my videos are always dark when it's kinda cloudy, and I don't like that. But yeah, we move. Huh? We move. Yeah. But I know you can see something. You can see the houses how it is, Mambo. You can see the houses how they are. The streets and everything. So these are the streets of Bombolulu. This is the kind of houses you can get here. Come on. Yeah. yeah. When you say shikamu is a uh, it's a obedience. It's the kind it shows you are respectful to the elders. Like you are greeting them with so much respect. Yeah. When you say shikamu, you can't just go and see a uh, old lady and you just say mom, hi, mambo, hi. hi. And you say uh, mambo, no, let's go, let's go. So yeah. Oh, mambo. So guys, these are the streets of Bombolulu. This is how Bombolulu looks like. God damn, it's kinda cloud, it's kinda dark. But I think you can see. So we are heading to uh Bombolulu Sports. It is a stage which is called sports. Uh-huh. Go this way. You see? You see, they have made some cabra road around this area. So there are some cabra road here. And it is very nice because, as you can see, this is a very nice road that takes you to the other side. So I won't, I won't follow this road because it takes you in a different direction. I'll just take this one so that we can go to the other side of uh, Ziwalangombe. Mambo. Yeah. Wow. And guys, I've noticed that uh, in this area of uh, Bombolulu, most of the houses are private houses. Like, they are family houses. People have just moved here and buy land here and uh, build their own houses. That's what I've can, I can see. I think in the neighborhood around here. Yeah? And they're like family houses. But when you go to this side again, close to the main road, is where you can get some rental houses. Yeah? So this is Bombolulu. So tell me, how how is it? How do you find it? Is it good? Can you live in this area, in these houses, or you can't? Tell me how you feel about this area. Because when I move, when I like walk in these areas, you can see how they are. We're going cooking samaki right here. Now, we are heading to Bombolulu's sports. Yeah. yeah. So, so this one, uh, we are just close to the main road, uh, the Mombasa Malindi Road. It's just in front of me here. 
So this stage here that I'm going right now is called the Bombolulu Sports. The stage is called Bombolulu Sports. As you can see we have a lot of businesses around here. Uh, Dukas, uh, we can see Mali Mali, people selling gas, electronics and everything. Also people cooking food right here for the residential, sweet potatoes. Wow, like so many businesses around. Oh, this is nice. So guys, people are working here. People are working hard uh, to make ends meet. I can see. So this is the Matatu stage. So this is the area which is called sports. Yeah. This is the area which is called sports. Uh, so this is the area which is called Bombolulu Sports. You can see. This is the road that uh, that comes from uh, town, the Mombasa CBD. This is the road, and this one is the road that goes to. Uh, it takes you to Malindi and uh, the other side of uh, of uh, the coast. 